I don't think we're in Kentucky anymore. Vampire Acrobat, she's called. Wow, very talented. They hooked us up with a candle. Hello, Willow Davis. How's it going? Highly requested. Highly, highly requested. I asked on, what, the YouTube community tab thing, what do y'all want to see from me this week? And a good number of people I was not expecting to see it said, where is Eric Cook being a wizard? Now, if you haven't been here long or maybe you just didn't tune in for it, I don't blame you. I started a series at the end of last year where I took the game Elder Scrolls for Oblivion. I made a character, Ericard Gare Cook, and let me scoop myself down while I'm talking here. Okay, anyway, we got we got very far in this series. Here's here's my guy, Ericard Gare Cook. He's a mage. He wants to join the Mages Guild. Well, I mean, he also has like the sword and the shield and stuff, but but he's got the magic powers too. Like that. And to be honest, I uh, I put a hold on this series as people didn't seem too interested in it uh, as it started getting... I can't, I can't talk while other people are talking. I have to step away from this conversation. Whew! So, um, it just... Uh, people didn't seem too interested in it, so I, I put it on hold for a while. But I, a good amount of people have been saying, where is it? I want it back. Bring back Oblivion with Eric Card Garrick. And thank you to all of you uh, supporting. I understand it's not the most popular of series, but clearly some folks were very into it. So uh, if you'd like to support, you know, uh, go ahead and try share it with someone who uh, you think might be interested in it. Now, as we left off, uh, I was still trying to join the Mages Guild, getting the recommendations from the different guilds. And I had just bought a house in the Imperial City in the water dis waterfront district. And um, we were interrupted by this this vampire hunt uh, from someone in the Imperial City. All of the previous episodes are still on my channel on a playlist. You can go ahead and watch those if you feel like it to catch up. But uh, I think it'd be just fine if you just start tuning in now. Uh, you know, I'll just explain things as we go anyway. So the last thing was I just got like a lead on this this vampire and where he is after I've been chasing him a while, I guess. But I do want to check out that house that I just freaking bought for all of my money. I have 24 septums left. Where is... I didn't mean to wait an hour. <laughs> Where is the waterfront district? Maybe I will just walk there. It is right down... Okay, I'm not walking. Travel right there and then walk into the waterfront district. I would like to go see my barren house that I have no money to furnish. He's finally doing it, y'all. He's finally moving out. Got his own place. We'll have to stop at, uh, once I get some more septums, we'll have to stop at, uh, ye, ye bath and body works. Ye, ye, ye fountain and corpus and... I'm trying to think of a weird way to say bath and body, um, but it just came out weird. Anyway, it's it's uh, it's nothing too pretty. I've been to the waterfront district house before, and the game is struggling right now. <laughs> hello. hello, yes, hello everyone. Hello, hello. Oh my god. I think this is it, right? What do you think? Not too shabby. Finally, I don't think we're in Kentucky anymore. Here we are, home sweet home. Yes, I bought the house. Okay, there's a bed. Hey, there's a bed. There's a fire. Could use some uh, some candles. Who lit this fire? There's candle. Oh, look, y'all. They they hooked us up with a candle. I wonder what the scent is. Probably nothing too party. Uh, but hey, we have a bed, and a fire, and a table, and... Great, hopefully I don't burn the house down with that fire. We'll, we'll take a an hour nap, 3.35, on Teardos. Okay, great, I'm so glad I checked out the house. Now, let me check out how far I am on the Mage's Guild. And then I'll probably go finish off that vampire quest real quick. Okay. Ooh. 
still need to go to Shaden Hall. Is Shaden Hall the last one? No, it can't be the last one. There's got to be like, I think I still have to go to Breville, Leowin. Yep, Breville, Leowin. I already did Anvil. I already did Bruma. I already did Skingrad. Okay, so there's three more Mages Guild things to do before I get into the Arcane University. But now I will. Let me see where we're at in that quest. I've discovered that Serator makes the occasional visit to a place called Memorial Cave. It's the burial site for many heroes that died in past wars. Serator supposedly has a relative interred there. Perhaps I should go investigate. And that place is not too far off from where we are right now. We're over there. So I'm gonna, I suppose, walk. And I, I won't bore you with all the details. Oh look, it's a different exit for the uh, the sewers that I escaped from at the beginning of the game. Y'all remember that? Oh, and, and there's um some mud crabs. Oh, that wasn't a mud crab. That was just a broken box over there. All right, onward. And I think we're. Is this it? This could be it. Oh, here we are, Memorial Cave. All right, is there anyone here who wants to kill me or something before I enter the cave? No, it looks pretty clear. This is where we house the, the fallen soldiers of past wars. This place has this place to bury the dead. Are you kidding me? I have entered Memorial Cave. It's now being used as a vampire den. I need to see if I can find Serator in here and put a stop to his charade. I'm not in the mood to fight a gang of vampires right now. But I shall. Okay, um... I'm, I'm gonna start sneaking at first just to see what we're working with here. By the way, I, I didn't get to say it really clearly before because I got flustered, but I do appreciate the people who, uh, ooh, look at that body hanging that's rotting. I appreciate the people who've been, um, requesting that this series continue. Um, it's just, it's just very nice of y'all, and, uh, I appreciate it. Be sure to smash like on this video because it does help it, you know, get around a little bit more. Spread spread the word. Share it with a friend if you'd if you'd like. Ooh, here we go. A skelly, a good old skelly creaking around. I suppose I should just start hitting him with some spells, or should I wait? Do you think that'll sound the alarm and uh, it'll bring other people after me? I don't know. Let's. It seems pretty clear over here. I think I could take him out without anyone else noticing. There we go. Take those torches, why not? I think I hear another one. Is that? Oh yeah, right over there. Maybe I'm too low of a level for there to be like actual vampires, so they're just like throwing some skeletons at me. <laughs> that That's a possibility. There's another skelly. There you go. Who's this? Who's this? <gasps> Ooh, spooky. What is... Th Are they wobbling? They're wobbling around. Is that like a zombie? It is. It's a one-armed zombie. Okay, still no vampires, though. Okay, come on. Oh, he's tough. Oh, he's tough, but he's not that tough. He ain't that tough! Whew. Okay. This is this is going quite well so far. Oh, his friend. I'm so sorry. Okay. Another zomb. This is easy pickings. Uh oh. Not too shabby at all so far. It's hard to come back to these games after not doing them for a while. <laughs> There's a freaking vampire right there, and I'm assuming that's a vampire. Okay, here we go. Ah, I missed. I missed. I missed. That's a shame. 
Oh god, don't give me vampirism. Oh wait, aren't vampires weak to fire? <laughs> Loser. Sucks to be you. Sucks to be you, I got fire powers. Uh oh, an angry wolf, uh, their, their vampire doggo. Their thrall. They're familiar. Woo! There we go. It was a wolf. Anyone else around here? Nope. Keep moving. Keep it moving. Aha! Stay right. I, my magic has not recovered yet, but... Oh god. Oh god. They're, they're an archer. They're an archer. Stop. Stop. Ooh! Ooh, we didn't get it covering that time. I, I keep missing. Okay, I'm gonna have to do this the the old-fashioned way. Crap, there's a zombie. This is getting bad fast. This is getting real bad fast. Heal up, heal up. I'm getting I'm getting double attacked here. Shoot the zombie. Shoot the zombie instead. Haha, <laughs> you hit the zombie. Oh man, this is this is not looking great. Thankfully, she keeps hitting the zombie. Okay, come on. You're done. You're done. You're done. You're done. Stupid vampire. At least I can't get infected with vampirism if she's just shooting me with arrows. Vampire acrobat, she's called. Wow, very talented. What what uh what vampires are doing in society this day and age? Okay, let's see. Let's see. That was suppose that was it. Oh, there's another corridor. Another corpse. Take your gold. Thank you. Another body in here. Body in here. I would like to get out the torch, but that would just be a whole big. Oh f! Did you just see that? Another freaking vampire wandering the halls. Huh? <gasps> oh god, they heard me. I missed, I missed. They didn't see me yet though, okay. Okay, now we're doing good. <gasps> Hell, he did, didn't even get a strike on me. Take this stuff from you. Vampire bard. They got bard vampires now? Were you gonna sing me a song to death? Actually, vampire would make a great barred with their uh, supposed manipulation skills. Oh god. Is that an orc? Or a dark elf? I can't tell. But there's two of them. There's two two vampires here. I guess they, the zombies and uh, skeletons were just uh, guarding the place. Oh my god, that guy got rocked. I keep, I keep messing that up. I gotta... Gotta block the arrows, and then shoot. Ouch. Oh, come on, stop moving! Okay, you're done. You, you tired! Alright. Heal myself up here. Vampire Assassin! Okay, now we're getting down to the, the meat of the operation here. We got the Assassin. And the agent. Vampire agent. The vampires hired an agent to uh, really try to make them look good in the public eye, apparently. Oh boy. What is, is this the head vampire now with the nice, with the sweet, the vampire sweet? With the fire and mushrooms and hanging bodies. Oh, it's... It, the vampire nightblade is is spawning something or or a bound weapon or something like that. I don't know. All right, take. Oh, oh, oh! She's invisible. She's in. Oh, now, but she made herself uninvisible by spawning a weapon or whatever. Ow! What was that? Was that silence? Oh my god! I'm silenced. I can't do any spells. Ow! Oh god, I can't do I can't do my healing spell. I can't do my healing spell. This must this is clearly the lead vampire here, right? Well actually no, because I'm looking for a, a different vampire. Um 
potion of healing. That did a good job. Let me do a damage health poison on my weapon while we're at it. Oh my god. Can I be unsilenced now? Oh, she's really doing some damage. Another potion. I'm really upset that I can't use my uh, restore health um, spell. Okay, alright, we're good. We're done. The Vampire Spell Sword. Wow, that was... That was brutal. Okay. Ooh, there's a key. And it open... Oh, it doesn't open this gate, though. Why is there a lock on this gate? And there's a dead captive. I've never heard a fly's sound effect before in this game, I don't think. Very interesting. We gotta take the money off of this dead captive, as you won't be needing it. Ah, and here is Saradar. Um, he will no doubt be alerted to my presence once I accidentally walk into these skulls here. Saradar, your time is up. Oh. H hello? You fool! Good. What's up? Did you really think that I'm surprised to see you here? I let you find me. What better place to get rid of you than all the way out here? No messy bodies left behind. No evidence. I was sloppy last time with Roland's lover, and Ooh. I won't make the same mistake twice. After I'm through with you, I'll find Roland and finish what I started. I knew hiring you was a mistake, but I had to keep up appearances. Oh boy. The damned order insisted we get you into the picture. I think after I'm done with Roland, Gillen and Greythroat will have to be dealt with. <gasps> Quite a list of things to do, wouldn't you say? Well, enough of my monologue. Time to feed. Oh god, this is spooky! What are you spawning? Oh god. Oh, you got some. What did you. You got some Daedric boots on you? Very nice. I gotta be honest, Serator, your your spell sword that you had guarding the door was a lot worse than that. I've slain Serator. I should return immediately to Roland's cabin and give him the news. Ooh, a silver short sword? Is that... That's not that good. Never mind. Serator, see, if you had hit me with the silence spell, I would have been done for. I'll take the house, the key to your house. You got some leather stuff. Meh. Blue suede shoes. Must be nice. You bitch. Alright, let's see. You got any goods in here? The headless zombie? Dead? Okay. Um. Stupid potions. Come on. Where's your loot? Do I get it later? Will the Order of Virtuous Blood, uh, give me a reward for defeating you? All right. Well, I'm I'm gonna head back to the Imperial City and uh, get the rest of this dealt with, I suppose. Um, yeah, uh, burn in hell, Sarader, and I'm out. Oh, I'm sorry. I have to return to the cabin of that guy who they tried to get me to kill, but I talked to him and he turned out not to be a vampire, and I gotta deliver the news to him. So here we go. Roland, no, no Roland. That's for sure. Okay, here. I'll just go in the side door that's still unlocked from last time I broke in to try to kill him. Hey, Roland. There he is. I hope you're here to bring me good news. Oh, yeah. Let me tell you all about Serider. He's dead? Oh, thank goodness. I feared I'd never be able to leave here, or worse, that he would come for me. I can finally return home. The ironic thing is that I think the Order of the Virtuous Blood should continue its work. Perhaps I'll speak to the others. Yes, I think that the Order will live on. Give me time to make arrangements and meet me in Seridor's basement. Bro, there's still more to this? Come on, I need to, I need to go get working on my friggin' recommendations. Let us never speak of that abomination again. Right, so what about vampires? Holy creatures. I hope we never see one in the Imperial City again. Unless I decide to become one, Roland. It's not usually worth it, though, so probably not going to happen.
All right, so now I have to go meet Roland in Serator's basement. I guess with the rest of the Order of Virtuous Blood. It's okay if you're lost. This is just a continuation of the last episode, and basically a guy in town was pretending to be uh, fighting vampires, but he turned out to be a vampire, and it's just this whole obnoxiously long thing. Entering Serator's house... Here we go. Here's here's the order. Sylvan, how's it going? I'm gonna just head to the basement if you don't mind. We could talk later, right? Hello. Hey, Roland. Hello again, my friend. How's it going? It's so good to see you again. You too. I've spent a good deal of time speaking with Gillen and Greythroat. They agree that the order should live on. Not only that, but we'd like to make you an honorary member. <gasps> If you're ever in need of our services, we'd be happy to provide them for you. Me? In addition, we'd like to reward you with this enchanted ring. Use it well in the fight. Oh my gosh, I'm so glad you made me an honorary member after I killed like friggin' eight vampires to get this far. Since you're an honorary member of the Order, if you bring back proof you've slain a vampire, we'd be glad to compensate you. Bring back the vampire dust from their remains. That should be proof enough. I have a few. Excellent. Another vampire has been slain. Here's your reward. What do I get? 250 gold! Wow. I got more. Oh my god, I got 250 for each one? Take them all, take them all! How much gold did I get? Oh, almost 2,000. Septums, how about that? Now let me take a look at this ring you gave me. Sneak, oh no, I'm sorry, Ring of Sunflower, Sunfire. Resist disease 15% on self, reflect spell, that's pretty effing good. Do I have a ring on right now? I guess not. That is a, reflect spell 11% is pretty effing good. Thank you, Roland, okay. That mission done. Let me head on over to a friggin' mage's guild. So, y'all, after all that, after the should I should I investigate the vampire thing in Bruma? You remember that when I was asking everybody, and then this thing, and I was and I said, hey, maybe Eric Cook would want to be. I'm sorry, Eric Hard Garrett Cook would want to be a vampire. Still not sure about that, but after all that. Vampires have been slain, and just, it's just a wonderful time to be our card Garrett Cook. Oh, I'm sorry, there was one more thing I needed to do in the Imperial City before I left, and that was talk to Boris at this bar. Uh, Boris is the guy who helped me escape the Imperial Prison, he's part of the Blades, you remember him, right? Defending the Emperor, yada yada. I have to go meet with him real quick. And uh, then I'll continue on with the Mage's Guild. Luther Broad's Boarding House. Gotta go meet my old chum, Boris. For old times' sake. There he is. Hey! Sit down. Don't say anything. Just do what I say. Ahem. Uh. <clears throat> right. What's up? Listen. I'm going to get up in a minute and walk out of here. That guy in the corner behind me will follow me. You follow him. Uh, I, I guess I, I'm... <laughs> I guess I'm ready when you are, Boris. Good. Remember, wait for him to follow me. I want to see what he'll do. I'll just be here. Eating some potato. Chillin' my my Oh god, we gotta go. Time to go. <clears throat> sneak sneak on by, sneak on by, sneak on by, excuse me. Oh god, where are we what's happening here? I'm supposed to follow this guy. Oh <gasps> what's going on? Oh my god, he's an agent! He's an agent. He was an agent of the Mythic Dawn. Enemy agent who has attacked. Boris is dead. I should find out what Boris has learned about our enemies. Search his body. 
I'll keep an eye out in case any of his friends are nearby. Boris, you're poisoned. Are you okay? You're hurt. You're green. You're glowing green, Boris. Mythic Dawn... He was a freaking agent. I have found a strange book about the Mythic Dawn cult. I should show this to Boris. Okay, Boris. I, if you're feeling up to it, I'd like to talk to you about this book I found. Good work. I am glad to see you, by the way. You just caught me at a bad time. What have you learned? The assassins who killed the Emperor were part of a Deirdre cult known as the Mythic Dawn. Apparently worshipped the Deirdre Lord Mayrunes Dagon. I've been tracking their agents in the Imperial City. I guess they noticed. Oh my god. Um, um, okay, uh, good news first. I found Uriel, Uriel's heir, Martin. Thank Talos he lives. Martin Septim, you say? We will restore him to the throne. It is the sworn duty of all blades. Uh, okay, now the bad news. The enemy has the amulet. What? They took it from Joffrey? Things are worse than I had thought. What's our next move? There's a scholar at the Arcane University. Tarmine is her name. Supposed to be an expert on Diedrich Colts. The Arcane University? Take that book to her. See what she made. <gasps> I'll keep running down leads on the Mythic Dawn Network. If you learn anything... You can find me at Luther Broads. May Talos guide you. Thank you. Tell me more about Tarmina. Like I said, she's one of the brains over at the Arcane University. Supposed to know everything there is to know about Deidre Colts. Okay. I hope you learned something from Tarmina about that book. This might just be the break you need. I get to go to the Arcane University. Ericard Garecook, the humble... Mage that escaped from a prison to save the Empire gets to go to the Arcane University. I mean, I, obviously, I don't get accepted into it, but we can just go look at it. What do you need, friend? Oh, I'm, I'm good. I was just going to go do that thing that we talked about. Take it easy, Luther Broad. Great in you have here. After all this time... I get to see the Arcane University. Me, the lowly Breton mage, Ericard Garecook. Oh. Oh, it's beautiful. Oh, wow. And they have a lovely mage friggin' uh, guard here. To Oh, a battle mage. How about that? The Legion battle mage. Wow, I cannot wait. It's, it's you, the hero of Kavach. This is truly an honor. Oh, please. It's an honor for me to be here. Wow. Oh my gosh, look at that. I am so ready to check out the Arcane University on the next episode of Elder Scrolls IV Oblivion with Eric Card Gare Cook. I'm Willow Davis. I hope you've enjoyed this. It's fun to get back into this again. Thank you for all the support. Smash like. I'll see you next time. Willow Davis, out. <laughs>